What you know about them long nights? Gonna fix it that you never had. Losing your niggas in situations, knowing that you can't get them back. I'm tryna focus on money making, I can't stop till I give me a bag. I'm talking my shit when I make it all the way to the top, ain't no looking back. Nigga, I done came up. What's going on, y'all? This your boy, Good Life Johnson, and I'm back with another video, y'all. Y'all already know the routine. You know, we back to show and prove videos with the mailbox opportunity. People still asking the same questions. You know, are you still making money with it? Can you still cast the checks? Same old, same old, even though I've been doing this for about three years now. All right, are we going on? Yeah, about three years, and uh, the money's still coming in like clockwork. You know, it's, it's a blessing, y'all. I know, however you want to look at it, this is the blessing to be able to get these uh, packages in the mail. However much it is, it don't matter. Really, it don't really matter, man. It don't matter if it's 25 bucks, 30 bucks, 50 bucks, 100 bucks, 1,000 bucks. Anything that's in these packages is a blessing, man. So, uh, hell, this can pay for gas, you know, food, whatever. So, you know, as far as with me, I'm thankful and grateful for everything that comes my way. I don't care what it is. Like I said, I don't care if it's $5 in this thing. <laughs> you know, I don't really care. You know, that's, that's a blessing in my book, you know, because that's $5 more than what I had. So, it is what it is. Uh, and that's why I try to put people onto this opportunity, man, because this can definitely change your life around if, of course, you if you put the work in and stay consistent with it. And, you know, on the road to success, man, it's a lonely road. It's definitely a lonely road. Uh, you're definitely going to outgrow a lot of people. Uh, no love loss, you know, and nothing like that, man. Y'all just on two different routes. You might be going one way, they're going a whole different direction, which is cool. Y'all might meet at the top or whatever, but... It is what it is, it's part of the game. And also when you're investing into a business opportunity, you gotta understand too, most of your friends and family members is not gonna understand what you're doing. They don't have the same vision as you. They don't understand, most of them don't understand about different investments and opportunities online, especially this online world. A lot of people, you know, of course, grew up with the offline, you know, working jobs and stuff like that. A lot of people don't understand the online, this online space and how to make money online. So they think everything is a scam or no, that's too good to be true or whatever, which is not the case. You know, if they just do a little research and, you know, step out their comfort zone and take a risk, they can do the same thing as well. I was once that person where I believed everything online was a scam. I used to be like that too, because I got scammed so many times. I was like, man, this, this probably gotta be a scam. But I said, hey, well, we're gonna find out. You know, I'm at least take a, I'm gonna take a chance at it and see what can happen. If I do get scammed, then I just get scammed, but at least I took a chance and found out. But some people are so scared to take a risk that they'll just keep on doing the same thing they've been doing for the next 20, 30 years and keep on struggling, man. You might as well take a risk at it. Another thing too, man, it's a win-win situation because a lot of people was asking me about the uh, the streaming opportunity. So a lot of people keep asking me, which one should I join? Should I join the mailbox? Should I join the streaming service? Which one is better for me? Uh, to be honest with you, you can't go wrong with either one because with the mailbox opportunity, the money comes in in lump sums. I can open up these these packages right now and I can get an extra, you know, thousand dollars that just came in or two thousand or three thousand or whatever the case may be. Whereas with the streaming service, it's something that you build up over time because it's that residual income. So I'm building up the mailbox, getting, I guess you can say fast money. But then on top of that, I'm also building up the, the streaming service, which is that long term residual income. So it's a win win situation. I personally would. I mean, obviously, I'm doing both. But, it, it, you know, if I'm. If I'm watching this video right now, I would go ahead, you know, if you got the money, I would go ahead and get started with both of them. That's just my personal opinion, you know, because also, even if you don't want to push the streaming service right now, hell, the service by the service alone is good. Just watching TV and having access to 7,000 channels and all that type of stuff, access to all the pay-per-view events, it's a, you know, it's a, it's a steal, man. For $39.95 a month, that's a steal right there. And then on top of that, I mean, you could make so much money on the back end with that service as well. Not even just the residual income part, but hell, your house is the new house where everybody's coming to watch pay-per-view. Hey, that's where everybody come to my house watch this fight. $10 at the dough. You charging everybody $10 at the dough. Shoot, you cashing out. Just off of that, you making three, 400 bucks, depending on how many people come to your house or whatever, but uh, you can have it set up on a projector screen or whatever, and you got pay-per-view. Have it throw a little swimming pool party or something like that. And then on top of that, you can have invite people to your crib and give a presentation on how the whole streaming service works or whatever. So there's so many different things you can do with that. Same thing with the mailbox opportunity. So many different ways you can grow this business as well. So it's a win-win. Uh, but that's just my take on it though. So if you do want to check out the streaming service, go ahead and click the link down below this video, or I might put the website somewhere on the screen. So just go to that website if you want to check that out. Uh, but with that being said, 
Let's go ahead and open up these packages and see what came in today. All right, so we're gonna start off with my mama's package real quick, see what she got. And like I always say, man, it's always a good feeling when my mama get a check or a cash or whatever it is. It's always a good feeling. Let's see, but this feels like a check though. Yep. All right, my mama's first check of the day. She got a check for 360. All right. I see my mama's name, Angela Starr, $360. Let's see. Okay, got a check for $220. All right, $220. Uh, okay, this is mine. These the rest of these is mine right here. So let's go to run through these real quick. Don't want to take up too much time. And like I said, anybody can do this, man. This is one of those easy opportunities. All right, let's see. Got a check for one thousand one hundred and twenty dollars. <laughs> this is crazy, y'all. One thousand. 120. Still to this day, man, it's just, it's, it's a shocker, man. It's just like, dang, like, the fact that I could just mail out postcards or pass out flyers or, you know, post videos on social media and the money just keeps on coming in. I'm very strategic on what opportunity I join. I don't just join anything, too. So if y'all realize, if y'all see exactly the opportunities I've joined in the past or uh, invested into in the past, y'all can see that they're all pretty like simple opportunities. It ain't no nothing uh, difficult about it. All right, so we got one for nine thirty. All right, see the name Eric Johnson, nine hundred and thirty dollars. Like I said, I always make sure I join opportunities that's that's very simple that everybody can do something fun to do as well. Cause anything I do, I gotta have fun with. It. I can't just do something just for the money. I gotta have fun doing it, man. Like, like you know, you got some people that's out there that's like one of my homeboys. He's a truck driver. Yeah, they make pretty good money or whatever, but he don't really enjoy it. So he's strictly just doing that for the money, and that can be, that can kind of uh, take a toll on you after a while, man. Like just doing something strictly for the money, like nah. Traveling the world and making vlogs and stuff. You know, yeah, I get paid. You know, I get paid to do that type of stuff. It's fun to me. I don't look at it like a job. I don't look at it like that. So, but at one point in time, it wasn't fun. I didn't, at one point in time, I wasn't. I was never like a video type of guy. So, but over time, I fell in love with it. So we got some cash. We got some cash that just came in. We got 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 50. So 350. It just came in. All right, 350. Then we got what? Two more. And two more. But yeah, man. You know, and as far as with me, man, like I just keep a small circle, man. When it comes to doing anything in life, man, just building a business, just living my everyday life, man. I just, I just feel like you know, less is more, man. I don't need a whole bunch of people around me. Like some people, they need hundreds of people around them all the time, 24/7 and stuff. Like nah, as long as I got my family, I'm straight. Yeah, I'm gonna my family on straight. Cause, let's see what we got right here. Got another check. Okay, we got a check for uh, 240. A lot of people, man, they just try to be around you cause, you know, for different reasons. You never know about the reasoning and why somebody wants to be around you and stuff. You know, I'm around family only. You know, people that was there from day one. Day one's only, I don't, I don't. I don't be around all these new ones, man. I don't really got time for that. Like I said, you never know what the next person is thinking, man. You never know. A lot of people, man, some people might be around you just because they nosy. They want to see what you up to, like just, just to be nosy. They don't really care about you like that. Some people, they just around you, hell, to to beg from you. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, I know you got money. Let me let me get some money. Can I borrow some money? Like, a lot of people around you because they want to know the inside scoop, you know, so they can try to set you up on the back end. Uh, 
a lot of people, you know, they just praying for your downfall. You just never know. So I, I keep my circle small, man. I don't, I don't. The thing too, man, is you can, you can get way more stuff accomplished too when you keep a small circle. You know, when you got all these people in your ear talking and this and that, back and forth. Just too much energy, man. Time being wasted. Cause a lot of people don't, like I said, they ain't got the same vision as you. They ain't on the same path as you. They ain't on the same grind as you. So a lot of times, a lot of people just wasting your time. And time is money. And money is time, man. And life is short. Life is definitely short, man. You know, life is definitely short. Yeah, man, you know, one of my uh, childhood friends just passed away. You know, and that's why you can't take nothing for granted, man. Like, damn, man. Man, it's crazy, bro. It's crazy, but it's life, man. Life goes on. You, you know, we gotta try to. That's why every day, man, I just try to, I just go as hard as I can. You never know when your last day on this earth is, man. Like, so you don't want, you know, you gotta just make, you know, you gotta understand your time is very valuable, man, and you gotta make the most of it. So, and you don't want to be around people that don't mean you no good and stuff. So it's just like, damn, man, it's just, it's a sad situation, man. Sad, you know. Sad situation, bro. Man, we grew up together, man, ever since, since we was one, man. It's crazy, too. I don't want to speak too much about it, but yeah, it's just crazy when I think about it. Like, I still don't even believe it's real, man, you know? Yeah, we grew up together, was diapers together. Elementary, middle school, high school together, like, it just, it's one of those situations where you just don't, you don't, you don't want to believe it's real, but. You know, that's why, you know, it is what it is, man. Uh, this pretty much, this is the last, this is the last, uh, this the last, uh, this the last package right here. So we got uh, 70, uh, I got 70 that just came in. And it's crazy, but it's just crazy, man, because my mama just talked to him not too long ago. Him and his mama and stuff, man, it's just crazy how life happens, how life, you know, you gotta just make the most of it, man. Make the most of your life while you're here, man. Just don't, don't wait, man. Just whatever you want to do in life, just go for it, man. Real talk. Real talk, man. Every day, just do what you gotta do. Take advantage of whatever. Do do whatever you wanna do in life, man. Whatever goals you have, whatever you wanna accomplish, just go hard. You know, uh, every day wake up like you know, just wake up and give it your all, man. You know, you just don't wanna wake up. You don't wanna wait till it's too late when you, you let 20, 30 years pass you by and you just like, damn, what, what did I do with my life? You know. Or you wanna you wanna create something, you want you wanna leave something behind. If you got kids, you know, whatever, leave something behind where they can at least get off to a good start or whatever the case may be, man. You never know when it's your last time, man, your last day on this earth, man. Let's go and let's go in and uh Let me take hold on one second, y'all. Uh, hold on. All right, y'all, let's go in and uh, count everything up, see what we got. And uh, let's just let's get back to it, man. Let's get back to it. Let's 
get back to it. Get back to this uh this grind, man. You know, no days off. I'm gonna count this up, then we're gonna head to the bank. All right, it's gonna add everything up real quick. Uh, so I had a check for 1,120. I had a check for 930. Uh, 240. Then my mama had a check for 360. And then uh, 220. And then as far as the cash, let's go to add this up real quick. We got 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 70, what's that, 120, so what's that, 420, all right, so plus 420, so we got a grand total of $3,290, all right, $3,000. All right, so let's go and roll out and uh, head to the bank real quick to cast these checks. Yes, sir. Let's get it. All right, just made it to the bank. Let's go and cast these out. Three different checks that I had. The total amount for those three different checks is uh, two thousand two ninety. Two thousand two ninety. Yeah. Hey, how's it going? How may I help you today? Yeah, I just want to cash some checks. Just cash. How would you like to cash back? Uh, you can do just, just all like, like hundreds, fifties, twenties, kind of mix it up a little okay. bit. Actually, no, just uh, just to make it easier, just all hundreds. Thank you so much, Eric. All right, thank you. Have a great weekend. All right, you too. Appreciate thank it. You. Yeah. We're going on three years with this, man. Three years. Yeah, sometimes what you can do, but I don't do this all the time, especially since the bank is about to close. I'll probably put like a drop card in here and there's somebody else behind me. So that's what I would normally do, but I ain't gonna do it on this round. All right, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's 1,000. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's two thousand, one hundred, two hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, ninety. That's two ninety. Two thousand, two ninety, y'all. So about almost three years later, and uh, still paying out, y'all. So <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I don't know what else to say, man. I'm always. Every, every opportunity I've ever become a part of, I've always showed proof. I've always, I'm talking about real deal proof. Not no just, oh, hey, you know, here's a check. You know, I show myself going to the bank, cashing out the check. Cause, Cause anybody can show a check, you know, which is cool. You know, you see a check from the company or whatever, but now can you actually cash the check? That's the most important thing. So I've showed proof uh, time and time again. So it's up to you. It's up to you to make that decision if you want to invest in yourself or not. Uh, either, you know, you can sign up for this opportunity or the streaming company uh, or both. You can check out the links down below this video. Like I said, both of them are great because with the mailbox, you can earn lump sums of money. Like you see right here, you know, uh, an extra 500 bucks a week, 2000 3000 whatever the case may be. Uh, with the streaming service, it's not going to be a lot of money up front where you're making like big time lump sums. But think about the streaming service as a long term income you know, a residual income where, you know, a year from now, or let's say six months from now, you're making like 5K a month or 10K a month, or even a year from now, you're making, you know, 30 or 40,000 a month. Look at it like that. It's a long-term type of, uh, it's a long-term game. So it's great to have both opportunities in my opinion. So uh, like I said, click the link down below to uh, get information on both of those opportunities. All right, y'all, so with that being said, you already know, man, it's Team Good Life. Right to the top is the team. Success is the only option. You already know, man, it's GLOE. It's good life over everything, y'all. Let's get this money. I'm out. I do this for my last name. Gotta carry it, got back pain. Got to light the lead away. I'm gonna carry it like the man. Was really in that storm. I don't care if you wasn't. Probably ran in your store, taking everything like it's nothing. Really from the mud, I could tell you how it wasn't.
I could tell you how it was. I could tell you we ain't had nothing. No, we had was each other. Them niggas ain't my blood, but them niggas like my brother. P.I.C. the pit piles, I could never leave my brothers. As you know, it been a while, they didn't miss a couple summers. Broke put the pizza down, his mommy going under. He loaded 50 rounds, ready to bring the thunder. Ready to bring the thunder.